Hello and welcome back to our hunger campaign for House Round 3. So when we left off, we had started off. Um, well, we had actually managed to keep on building up our units and just getting ready for the invasion of Germany. So it's created another corpse here. So it's going to create the HQ, and in fact. You guys can all start moving over then. And I'm going to place an infantry division here and reorganize this lot. Perfect. So now we've got three corps on this side of the map. Um, I actually need to add them to the HQ. Just three have tasks. There we go. So we need two infantry divisions for these two, um, but we'll sort that out. So we had tasks now covers a lot of the Eastern Front um, and we're now pretty well defended against the German invasion, our counter invasion back towards us. What we need to do is we need to be swift and fast so these guys will move up and take positions along the, the German border um, to try to prevent them from getting back to help them out but also to hopefully um, cut off supply to them or at least disrupt it. Especially depending on the um, the type of laws that they have, um, the occupation laws. That's it. Let's see over here. We should come back down. Uh, where's our HQ over here? There it is. We need to come over here then to attack this unit, and then preferably you should come down over to. Malmo to defend against any potential crossing. So, yeah, straight with Malmo. Okay, so yeah, we need to defend Malmo then um, from troops crossing over. Doesn't have a great fort, but we'll work around that. Making sure as we're still going for advanced construction engineering. We want that because of our infrastructure, which, uh, if we have a look, the Eastern Front, all in India, has to go through very badly, uh, very bad infrastructure. So we're probably going to increase some infrastructure around this area to allow for a line to run around to the east. Well, should be okay. I do say should be though. Uh, so it's gonna continue the game for the moment. I say just keep on producing uh, all of our units ready for the great invasion. So Soviet Union is on 72% um, surrender progress. Uh, commander decision making. Stop that. Increase officers. Oh, we're really getting quite low now in our officer ratio. We need at least 47,000 officers. Wow, we need a lot more then. A lot more. We're currently putting 6.4 into officers. It's not the best, but it's best we can do at the moment. In India, how's this lot going? Well, we created our army group, didn't we, over here? Where is it now? First army. No, it's not that one. Second army. So we're going to tell them to attack. Blitzkrieg, please. These guys will hopefully kill off all the remaining uh, rebels in the area. Not really lost anything, so that's good for the moment, although some energy from there. That one was awesome over there. That's fine then. Um, stop that and go for there instead. Perfect. This unit is still in, in supply somehow. Well, at least this unit's coming down to sort them out. So is this one. So they'll eventually get there and deal with it. Uh, 
won the battle there, so we should fully destroy these units. You need to move down here to in fact attack there, even though you're the Caribbean HQ. Sweden, yeah. Okay, you move down there at speed then, please. Um, Production-wise, we probably need some more escorts now, although our convoys are doing quite well. So escorts, we'll do two in parallel. We're going to do... That take a long, long time. Longer than we have, actually. Uh, so it took about four years to create them up. So that'd be beyond the timeline of this game. <laughs> 240 days to produce them. Okay, we're going to do four in power then. We should have started these a long time ago. Okay, we're going to move to there using strategic deployment uh, the Germans, how are they doing? 72% so they're so we sort of taking back some land the Germans are struggling with the American revolts so this might actually be a good time but I do want to wait for all these divisions to produce, which will be done on December. <coughs> I just want to finish this revolt. Okay, try to attack them straight away. Move on through. Uh, Japan, money and fuel. I uh, don't really need it. Got plenty of both now after them upgrades that we got. Perfect. Yeah, I definitely should have started the escorts a long time ago. What's the class that has the transports? Not transports, the um, escorts. I'm not entirely sure. Reduce that. Reduce that. Put it down to what we need. We need to get the upgrades done. Production wise, let's just increase this slightly. There we go. Get these guys off. And we'll move down here. These guys are now starting to attack our transports around Brazil. Not good. Not very cool of you guys. Oh, don't mind too much. And we've almost completely taken back all of our land. There's Blitzkrieg stance. Take it back. It's not worth anything, but why not? There we go. Taking that land back. And I'm going to take back the land over here as well. Beautiful. So if I should manage to take over one of the key cities down here, so potentially they've got supply over here, these units, and can cause some trouble for the uh, Japanese down here. Perfect. Technology, production, what we're producing. 
a lot. A lot, a lot. Um, to get over to the Minicum Republic, we need more units. Of course, that's what Kabi and HQ is for. And we've got two garrison divisions here ready to go. And I have plenty of manpower and not enough officers. <laughs> Destroy anti aircraft armament, um, escorts. That's pretty good at the moment, but we want to keep it going. Just not quite high enough for my liking. Uh, capital ship as well, not quite high enough. Okay, now, wh what are you guys doing? Come on, get down there. Gonna stop them too, I think key and stop this one as well. Oh, we won the battle. <laughs> South Africa exists again, it's not loud. So the 9th of December is when we will attack. Actually no, we need to wait a little bit for them to actually regain some of their organisation. Uh, you will attack there, and then you can attack this and go down to Malmo. <coughs> Come on, what are you doing? Can you get there? Mm, eventually. Um, so how are they doing? Oh, where did the where did the Germans lose some of their ah Moscow? Looks like the Soviets are pushing the Germans back. This could be a team key a key time to strike. Because this means that the Germans might have been weakening and may have lost their manpower. And if they lost their manpower. Well, they're in deep trouble. Let's keep an eye on their surrender progress, 47.9. Let's keep a look on the battle lines. Radar stations, which is kind of just another, say, 10 of them. We could do in favour of reducing our supply production again. Lost Cape Town, that's bad one for us. Looks like we're going to win back our promises. And then it will mean that we can then prepare to attack uh, this the Japanese down here in India as well. Do you want to keep increase that one slightly? Oh, well, no, but yeah, I should do that one then. I'm not sure why it's still got miles 0.07%. Uh, now it's going down. Also, if our level, level of IC, that's quite a lot, even just 1%. 272. Still 272. Mm. Yeah, so it's still lined up on our border, weirdly enough. Despite the Germans pushing into their land. Attacked and Kutak and won both of them. Okay, we're gonna just arrive there and then we're going to move all of our units back over. Not all of our units, but them units back over. See, so second army, we'll remove that and we'll place. Hmm, where's a good place? Say, ah, ah come on. Hydro are bad. Uh, 
technology wise, uh, land, I'm going to stop that. I'm going to put it once again into officer ratios. Production wise, yeah, we're going to stop that now. Okay, so that. Our upgrades are finally nearly nearing completion. And production was just a day away. Risen in Kutak. Did we just lose the Battle of Kutak somehow? How the heck did we just lose Kodak against some militia? That makes very little sense. And actually it's quite a lot in manpower and leadership. So please do take that back guys. As for infantry, we... Let's see what we want. <coughs> we have... First hard test, one, two, three, four, five full corpse there. Second hard test, one, two, three, four corpse. But that'll probably increase with the recent productions. One, two, three, four. And how do you have one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two. So yeah, that'll it's increase it to full. So you want uh, probably two more corpse. So another 12. <clears throat> Beautiful. And then what we'll do is we will place them here somewhere. Where do we want them placed? If these guys move over, they can concentrate on France. Um, I'm going to put these. Maybe on the western road over here to fight the German army. Okay, so one, two, three. These guys will go into these three slots. One, two, three, four, five, and then six. And that'll be the fifth of these guys up here. <coughs> okay, and then these guys can move together to go up and west. Uh, these guys can go north. And these guys can, in fact, move. They can stay there for the moment. I don't expect much resistance in Germany. These guys can actually move back over here. Go for one, two, three, four, and five. Okay, and just let all these units move into the correct positions. Infantry organization has been done. Stop that. Juice this. Bleed the neck. These guys are moving on like something, something else. Okay, so we've got to then push these guys into here. Cape Town is what we've got to take back. In fact, now they're bringing down all these units. <laughs> It's fine by me. So what we're going to do is we're going to wait for these guys to take back there and get into position and then we will attack. Let's see this. So in the progress it is still at 47.9%. Won the battle at St. George and we can produce infrastructure. That's great news. South Africa is only a uh, militia brigade, so we should be able to defeat that fairly easily. Elsewhere, how are we doing? 
We're about to take over that do province there we have done. So now we're going to look at taking over Hyderabad and Calcutta. We'll take over Calcutta first and then move down. Um, oh, Pete's sake. Okay, second army. You will now go after the Americans. I'm just going to put them out there and then I'll send me a Japanese. These guys are still moving into position. The armor division is further up north, that's fine. Give me a second. First, Hattest doesn't have any room for another division, does it? One, two, three, four, five. It doesn't. So we're going to add these ones in. Uh, okay. I'm just going to take one of you guys. Reorganize. And then this one is the 15th corpse. Add to the 15th corps. Let's see how we're doing over here. We're being attacked, which is bad news. Because it's metal for us. So they're just going to lose us half the game, I think. <laughs> this AI is funny as hell. My word, we've got a load of vaults per. Well, go and kill them off, please. Um. So who else were we looking at then? So these guys are no longer... Hmm, they have more troops. If these guys are no longer attacking down south, should we move them? No, we're going to help them. Yeah, I think the Italian army is much weaker than the German ones. We're going to use them in the German assault. These guys here, one, two, three, four, five. Sixteenth corpse, sixteenth, sixteenth. This one will be added to the third hat test. That then the HQ can stay in the middle. You guys can move along one like so. I think the Germans are now predicting some sort of attack from us. So we will need to move quite speedily now to keep this element of surprise on our side. This division here shall go to the second hat test. And then I think we're just about ready to begin the offensive. Absent. Our officer ratio is still really severely low. What the hell are you guys doing all the way down there? My god, you're insane, man. Did we lose that battle against militia division? Oh, because you're out of organization. Because you're out of supply. Damn it. Oh, 
Oh, we taking parts of the... Oh, okay, why not? Sure, go ahead. Take all this land if you want. Just needs less for the takeover from the damn Japanese. Beautiful. Alright, and you guys are now going to... Uh, you guys. After you've taken over these territories, will be set to attack the Japanese. And the leaders, we still have plenty of leaders, that's fine. Production, we're going to decrease that. Yeah, these guys just aren't getting any supply anymore. Well, supply issues in uh, Africa are not going too well. Okay, you guys have all won the battle, so now we're going to set the new target of Calcutta. Now we're going to do Hyadura, but. <clears throat> so we uh, I think we're going to do it now. So I'm gonna end the episode here. Thanks for watching. Um I'll see you next time. Bye and ciao for now.